everyone welcome to my channel i hope everyone's well um i hope everyone's had a lovely easter as well um yeah so i've come on to give you a little look at what i've got planned for april i always have to think what month it is <laughs> um yeah i am still working on my mum's cards <coughs> i've only got got nothing else done on these but i am working on the leaves for them now i've got all these to cut out um i have cut these out so far how many have i done i don't even know i don't even know how many i've done but i've got a lot more to go yet little leaves out of a stamp these were from a stamp if you didn't see my finished completed pages and crafts so yeah i've still got them to do i do a few at a time because it gets a bit boring so i'm doing them <clears throat> and then once they're all cut out i can get them cards done and finished also i want to do i want to try as well is put instead of putting a gem on them cards i want to try and do a well i've got loads of ribbon and i've seen on face on not on facebook on youtube how to make tiny little ribbons with a fork <laughs> so I'm going to attempt to do it and if it comes out all right I'm going to film it there's loads of videos out there of doing ribbons with forks but I'm still going to I'm still going to put it up there um but yeah I've watched a few people doing them on YouTube and they are quite old videos but um I thought I'll watch a few in case because I'm quite cl uh, clumsy with my, my hands and fingers so I thought I watch a few and see if any uh, look a little easy, but they look all about the same. So I'm going to attempt it. Let's see how this, watch this space. So, <clears throat> sorry, my throat's really bad today. Um, My plans also are, because at the like New Year's resolution type, type thing, I don't really do them, but the thing I wanted to do this year was to draw more and i've hardly i think i've done one what was the last one i did let's have a look let's have a laugh at my drawings oh no that was december i haven't done anything then have i i've not done anything for this year so yeah i want to do at least five drawings this month in this little sketchbook they're only really little little sketches but i find it satisfying and really even though i'm not very good at drawing i find it relaxing and satisfied that i've done that and i've learned how to do that and i've i have done that myself if you get what i mean even though i do follow some of the tutorials but i do look at photos as well just to make sure i've got the proportion right and i'm better at doing it that way <clears throat> also right so my coloring plans let me just move these these uh, cards because they're gonna get scratched or something yeah so coloring i have got the tarot occult gothic coloring book by rachel mintz and this is out every month now just because something easy quick to work on if i'm in a bit of a slump and I want to finish that book one day. Also, I have got Tales from the Forest Kingdom. Are we in frame? Because I know what I'm like. Tales from the Forest Kingdom by Hannah Carlson. Never touched this book. I never touched this book. And if you can hear a tinkling, my, my neighbour's cat's in. My friend's cat's in our house because she's out for the day. So he's in here. If you heard the little tinkling bell. Um, yeah, me and Kirsty Colour and Sketch are doing a body colour on this page. I've never done a body colour with Kirsty, so I did reach out to her and see if she wanted to do a body. So we're doing this one. Um, yeah, it's a busy month, isn't it? Especially if we've got kids, kids off school and what have you. So we're doing this one, a little single page. I don't know, is it a dragonfly? Or is it just, I think it's sort of dragonfly, isn't it? I've got a sort of idea how I want to do it, but I'm not 100% sure. 
but yeah it could be nice to get a page done in this book so thanks Kirsty for uh, got buddying up with me so Coloring Heaven Fairy Topia Special and I have picked this page because I can't remember who it is but someone's doing a hashtag for mushrooms and I like my portraits still you know April sort of Easter isn't it time still so the rabbit mushrooms I like that I've done a few in this paint in this book now as well because I don't have any of uh, Misty Cart Mirror's books so all I've got is this of hers so it's nice to have it's oh my pages are gonna my books are gonna slide off yeah it's nice to have that so I have Enchanted Faces Mermaids Fairies Fantasy Pocket Size Colouring Book by Hannah Lynn and I have uh this page yeah i don't know why i picked this page because i think this is a christmas page i don't know now i've just seen that and that reminds me of that flower at christmas what's that plant the red plant so i might change my mind now i don't know Oh, I could do it anything though, couldn't I? I could do it like a lily or something, not a lily, but I could do it something else. It'd be fine. It just threw me off seeing that. But there's like palm trees or something there, so. Yeah, I'm going to do that one, I don't care. But there's some lovely ones in here. Yeah, so there's that one. There's a little quick one. And then I have 50 Prehistoric Miniatures by Camellia Angelkova. And I think I've only got two pages or one page done in here. But I picked that one, look, because the little egg, Easter time, and of course it's a cute little dinosaur. So yeah, I'm going to do that page. It's really sweet. There's some really cute ones in here. Like, look at that. I think there's a flip through this in my channel somewhere. Yeah, so there's that one. I've also picked, I picked a lot of springy Eastery pages. Uh, Circle of Life by Mel Pinini, and I'm not saying a second name because I can never say it. But I have picked this page. Because it's the, you know, the chicks, the eggs, the chicks turn into the chicks, uh, chickens. So I think that's perfect for this time of year. Spring, it's definitely a spring page. I would like to do that. And I'd love to do another page in this book because I always enjoy it. Always. I don't know if that was the last page I did. And I can't remember. Oh, I think that was the last page I did in here. But yeah, so Circle of Life. And I've neglected my uh, Colouring Heavens a little bit. So... I thought it's about time I did an Ennis Guerrero page because uh, this is my favourite book, favourite Col uh, Colour in Heaven book and when I was looking through I saw this one, just checking in frame again and mushrooms look again so what will go for that hashtag, I really, I can't remember who, is it Norma Colouring? I can't remember, I did uh, put it onto my stories when I saw it I, I, yeah, I can't remember now who it was. I'll have to look it up. Um, yeah, so mushrooms. I know it's a bit creepy with the eyes, but it's still mushrooms. And another portrait page. So, yeah, this is my favourite Call in Heaven my, uh, issue ever. So, yeah, that is what I've got planned for this month. Let's see what I get done. So, if you like this content, please get a thumbs up. And uh, I'll see you next time. Thanks. Bye.